Hey everyone, welcome to the Horror Show. I'm Cecil Laird. I'm Marsh Parker. I mean, Fuego here. And uh, we are back to do a trailer reaction. And I don't know if you guys know this, but very early on in our Horror Show career, uh, Marsha actually took part in the escape room experience. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And we actually interviewed the creators for our podcast. Thing. Right? It was before uh, the escape room became like a big thing everywhere. Yep, yep yeah. indeed. It was it was the earliest escape room that I remember in Phoenix. Mm -hmm. um, and we did it. Now, uh, it was a lot of fun. You basically go into a room and you have to figure out puzzles to get out of the room. In this particular escape room's case, we had a zombie on a chain in the corner. <laughs> the chain would lengthen by a foot every like 10 minutes or something like that. Yeah. And Damn. we had like an or hour to get out of the escape yeah. room or something mm -hmm. like that. And so uh, it was a lot of fun. This one is called No Escape Room. What? So I don't know I don't if they're playing any with that. Riddles here. I'm guessing that this is an escape room gone wrong, which makes perfect sense. I'm surprised it took this long for a movie <laughs> to come out like this. I'm guessing it has no ties to the Ray Liotta film No Escape from the 1990s. Uh, yeah, I'm guessing you're fucking right. <laughs> so glad you took the time to bring that shit up. <laughs> All right, here we go. It's a good movie. <laughs> In three, two... I like that he doesn't defend it. He's like, good movie. What? <laughs> oh, whatever. Fuck with me if you want. Come at me, bro. It's a good one. All right, here we go. Three, two, one, go. Mm -hmm. What's there to do around here? I know you're upset. I'm going to make it up to you. I'm not upset, okay? Oh, they moved. Uh -huh. Hey, it's the guy for the league. Uh, it's uh, that's not cool. Maybe not. Let's take a look. Are you thinking Charlie like Day? Bowling, movies. <laughs> Wait a second. Escape rooms. You said you wanted oh. to try uh, Excuse me. Oh, you take it from me. You go up there, you're going to have <laughs> one hell of a time. Oh, oh. I'm Michael. This is my daughter, Karen. Melanie. Uh, this is Tyler. How about you? You here alone? No, I'm on the plan. I'm with the escape room. Really? Oops. No. Okay. The game begins. So, what do we do now? We play. What exactly does a clue look like? Look at the masks. Now we gotta find the combination. Cool. I thought it was escape room, not rooms. <laughs> Can you just and relax. Ooh. Ooh. I like this. Hello? God, Tyler, your ear. Are we trapped in here? Yep. Wow. I think we signed up for some experiment. I didn't know it was going to go like supernatural. I like the music. Ooh. Clever title. Two guys, they walk into a bar and one guy says to me. Oh, well, well, I guess we know what happens to that guy. <laughs> all right. <laughs> so I think he was in on it. <laughs> He's a plant, all right. Mm -hmm. uh, Marsha, your initial thoughts. I like it. Um, you know, like you said, it's amazing that we haven't seen a movie like this come out yet since it's such a big thing right now. Mm hmm. Uh, I like the idea of it being a father and daughter movie. They're going in together, uh, trying to bond and trying to make her feel better. The fact that he moved her out to the woods, which is, you know, basic horror movie trauma. Um, but it looks good. It look, I like the cast of characters. They all look interesting. Looks like they all play well together. I like the rooms. I like the, the slow appeal in the music. Mm -hmm. uh, so... I'm excited. I think this would be a good find. Fuego. I thought this was going to be really bad. And really? It's not. It <laughs> actually shows, it shows merit and uh, some promise, I guess. Uh, once again, liking the, the little dynamic between you know father, daughter, and stuff. I'm actually liking the fact that it's not containing it to just one room and that they are implementing a little bit of a super or seemingly supernatural aspect mm -hmm. uh i and i thought the production value was going to be a little bit lower than it actually is and that adds some heft and some you know validity 
and everything. And I like the design of this house too. Mm -hmm. I honestly really do. It's cool. And uh, yeah, I would uh, I would Netflix this. I, I should tell I might even VOD it. You don't know. So cool. Yeah. All right. Good. No, yeah, I, yeah. I I actually agree with you guys. I think this did a lot more with the premise than I was worried they would do. Now, they didn't stick on any particular angle long enough to see if it was good or if it was really cheesy. Like, a couple of the <clears throat> acting moments seemed like they could come off pretty hammy. Yeah. But... The only thing. But, yeah, everything else looks like it's pretty, you know, pretty fun. Not necessarily the most unique thing we've ever seen as far as mm -hmm. execution goes, but it doesn't look like it's, it's also... The most non-unique thing we've right. ever seen. You know, it does look like it does some interesting things, some things we've seen before. Yeah. But that's not a bad, you know, <laughs> that's not a bad ratio, if you ask me. It looks like they have enough money behind it to make it worth watching, too. I agree. I agree. And, and having been through an escape room, Marsha, you can attest, like... It, it was like that. Yeah, well, absolutely. Yeah. Was, Multiple I don't rooms, even know how mansion, we made it. And people trying to kill us the yeah. whole time. Yeah. It's and surprising it we never did a vlog about that. <laughs> Um, but <laughs> I actually had no idea you two even did this together. Oh, oh really? You yeah. must yeah. not be a fan of our show. Yeah, I thought you were. We had a podcast. We did a whole think? podcast about it. We did the we did a podcast mm -hmm. with the owners of it. Mm -hmm. Actually, talking about it, it was a lot back. of fun. We really do. Back, Honestly, now that there are so many out there, we should really see if there's a Halloween theme one, and I'll pay to have us go do it. Oh, I would be down to do it again. It uh, was I a think lot that was that would be a fun if they have it on Sunday. I think that'd be a fun way to do it. Really? Would you be down? Are there's, you a puzzly guy? There's like a part of me I'm that really is, like, it. is like <laughs> I'm settled good. by the You're idea, really and then there's another part of me that's intrigued by Remember it. Remember I so. injured myself because I fell? <laughs> I yeah. did. I fell, but I was also... I sacrificed myself for the betterment of the group. <laughs> <laughs> and I and I got I got voted the most brainy of the yeah. group because I solved the most puzzles. So, so yeah. then it was the both of you along with other people, we, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We, it wasn't just us. No, like, no, no. Pete came, but then we were in the room with other uh, people who... There was like eight people total or something yeah. like that. Yeah, okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it was, it was a lot of fun. We um, It was uh, actually the children's acting group in um, Awatuki yeah. that actually ran it, so... By the time I uh, really by the time I upload the episode, I'll try and link to that podcast mm -hmm. at the in in, in the background. Yeah, or at the at the end. But yeah, so. this is looks this was very similar to the experience we had with that children's acting group, and uh, I'm surprised we're still alive. Mm -hmm. Yep, I'm glad that you both are though, yeah. so that we can share this trailer reaction yeah. together. <laughs> <laughs> no, this looks good though. I'm excited. Um, I, obviously, this is probably just this is probably not going to make it to theaters. Hopefully no. it makes it to Netflix or something I can watch it on. So It'll make it somewhere. I mean, even if it's Prime Video or whatever. I mean, I, 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 that's where... This doesn't look like it's too far off from American Hell Fest or American Fright Fest, mm -hmm. um, which was, you know, it, it, it. they got the Dylan Walsh from Nip Tuck. So, oh, okay. Um, you know, they. it looks like it could have at least that much behind it. <laughs> yeah. So um, I'm excited about this. Why don't you guys let us know in the comments down below. Are you excited about this? Have you ever done an escape room? Would you be interested to watch a movie set around an escape room gone mm -hmm. wrong? I Do think it's... Go to an escape room with us. Yeah, you want to go to an escape room with us? Join Patreon. a chance to yeah, go to Patreon. Go to an escape yes, room with the horror it. show. You know, mail yourself down to Arizona and we'll go do it. So, um, yeah. There is that really big high tier one if you want to be on an episode. That's true. Yeah, hey, that's mm -hmm. true. There, we do have a we do have a tier where you can come be on the show with us. It's yeah. It's ridiculous. It's, check it out in the explanation. <laughs> when you click on it. Come to Patreon. I basically yeah. am like, there's no reason why anyone should click on this. <laughs> uh, but anyway, um, why don't you guys let us know in the comments down below? Are you excited about this? Until next time, I've been Cecil Laird. I'm Marshmallow. Gracias, up in Jaime Fuego. And remember, stay, stay scared. scared. Patreons. Bye. I'm trapped in a room.